Your CAD stream computer has to manipulate and organize large volumes of data, and it tries to accommodate multiple vendors, as well as protocols and individual site and, and radiologist preferences. It's kind of hard to imagine that occurring, at least without an occasional glitch or hiccup in the system. This is particularly true when you're first establishing your system, when you're first setting up your protocols or first setting up your CAD stream computer. This is one reason we feel it's very important to have a single lead radiologist and lead technologist so that there's some consistency each day working through the cases and trying to streamline the workflow and your CAD stream. CAD stream has a very qualified application staff that's readily available for phone consultation or in some instances to log on to your system directly to assist you with problems. In this initial release of MRI Advance, we're going to illustrate just one of the more common glitches or errors that occurs with your CAD stream system, particularly when first setting up your program. We'll also show some options you can take to start looking into what caused it, at least so you can communicate with your application specialists and they can help you in a quick manner. One of the more common technical issues confronting CAD stream users, particularly as they're setting up the breast MRI program, is one of these errors where you say, where it says no matching study preferences or incomplete or just failure to process. This is most commonly due to errors in naming the study or in naming the individual pulse sequences. CAD stream has to be able to recognize what kind of exam has been sent to it in order to know how to process it. Additionally, it has to recognize the pulse sequences so it can pick out what is the dynamic run, what is the pre and what is the post contrast imaging. This is an important thing to do the same way every time, to name very precisely, and this is another reason it can be very helpful to have a single technologist initially as you're setting up your program. One thing that can help you, if you go under the study preference and click on the study preference, this will open up a window as you call your application specialist, if you can tell them the errors that are at the top of this list, this can help them to quickly deal with your problem and address it. As you become more familiar with CAD Stream, you may be able to actually go in and edit these hanging protocols and therefore get your system to process the study without any further delay. This is something though that comes just with experience as you work with your application specialist and become more familiar with setting up some of the processing features of your CAD stream.